Right, hello, this is how to install the Lion King mod 1.9 in vanilla Minecraft and Bungie MC as well because some people on the forums, unbelievably, um, him seem to be having trouble installing the mod. So I'm going to do a, another installation video despite the fact it's a mods folder mod which is very easy to install. Anyway, um, What you want to do, you want to go to percent up, that's a percent. I apologise, I've got cold while doing this video, so. You want to go ahead and go into your bin folder, delete your Minecraft jar, because you don't, you don't need that anymore, that's got the old version, plus that's still on 1.4.5. Now what you want to do is you want to navigate to wherever your Minecraft.exe is, mine just happens to be in my downloads folder because I don't use minecraft or you can see I don't use the vanilla launcher that often so I just keep it in here you want to force update your minecraft you want to log in, wait for it to download all the mods and again I don't care if you see my email address I really don't because this is only going to be a private video it's not going to be public because it, it doesn't need to be public Unless he wants it to be, and then unless me, me Vans wants the video to be public, in that case, I will make the video public. Right, what you want to do now is you want to quit. You want to go ahead and download Minecraft Forge for the latest one, which I will link you to this forge.minecraft.net. You want to go ahead and download the Universal. Wait for the ad fly while that's doing that. You want to go ahead and go back and do page one. And now once that's done, you want to download it. You want to open it. Go back into your bin. Right click on the jar, open with your open, open with your archiver. Go ahead, go in here. Select all, drag and drop, press OK. I want to go ahead and delete the meta room. I know there's a meta room folder in there, but I always delete it, it always seems to work. Now you want to go, in, go back into your Minecraft AXE, go ahead and log in, make sure our forge is working. Which in my case it is, now that Forge is on, you want to go ahead and where you located your Lion King picture from, um, your Lion King mod, sorry, which for me will be in here. I actually exited it by accident. I'll search for it. The Lion King mod version 1.9 you want. Version 1.9, there you go. Now you want to go back, to, back into your app data. Go out of the bin. Go into mods. For some reason I've got Hugo Craft and Moral Creeps in there. Because I didn't, I didn't delete it. What you want to do, drag. Lion King mod version 1.9 to there and then you want to go ahead and start you want to go ahead and start Minecraft hang on okay now you've started Minecraft I'm, I'm going to cut my editing down to a minimum and that's how you go ahead and install the Lion King mod even though I just quit right now what you want to do to make sure it's properly installed, you want to go ahead and install TMI. Because NEI is not actually installed. Uh, NEI isn't updated, sorry. What you want to do is you want to go ahead and get too many items for 1.4.6. Open that up, copy, select all them. Go into your Minecraft jar, paste it, 
click OK, exit TMI, exit your Minecraft jar because you've done that, and then go ahead and start up Minecraft again. Once you're into Minecraft, you want to wait for this. Five mods installed, as you can see we've got TMI and the Lion King mod now installed. Go ahead and go into single player. Now uh, you see you've got tool tips, dirt and seeds because of 1.5.6. Now you've got TMI and you're free to dirt through items as you like. Yep. That's how we install it in vanilla. Now, this is how we install it in multi MC. Installing it in multi MC is a lot easier. You want to create a new instance, call it something like okay. And then let me pause again. That's just while I log in. Now it's downloading all the packages you need for Minecraft Jar. Hurry up. Oh, of course, yeah, it's, it will be stuttering because right, everybody's downloading it. Right. What you want to do now is exit, click close, right click. Edit mods, MC Forge, and the latest version of MC Forge 1.4.6. Go ahead, go into your mods folder, and I'm just gonna make it simple. I'm just gonna add in the mod from my other one I've got. Um, where is it? Gonna go ahead and add it in here from there. I'm gonna do exit, log in, and then log in to make sure it loads up. As you can see, it's it loaded. Now you want to install TMI, so you want to go ahead, edit mods, Minecraft Jar, add. And then go to where it's downloaded. You can search for it again, like we did last time. Too many items. You want to go ahead and add in the latest one. Then you. I apologise. Then you want to log in. I apologise for cutting that off short. Now, as you can see, we've got too many items, and also the linking mod installed. Too many items being the crappy version, not enough items being the best version. Anyway, that's the install video. Goodbye.